Hey, I'm V. I'm a property manager with HNFC Stays. We're a short-term accommodation provider in England. We have five employees, five contractors, and we rate a listing for. When we've had only two properties, we've realized we need some sort of a channel manager because it's really hard to maintain all your listings on Airbnb, Booking.com, Verbo, and up listing it's very easy to implement, has a good price, and it was our first choice, to be honest. So the reason we chose up listing is because a colleague of mine who actually does their own short-term rental business suggested. So we thought, okay, we're going to give it a try. And then, as I said, it's very simple to use. Uh, integration is very simple. The customer support is great. It's probably one of the best uh, features of having a listing. They're always happy to support you there. And the whole process was very smooth. So starting with up listing is pretty easy. Yes, there are a few things you don't know how to do. Yet, if you reach out to a support team, a live support team, which is really important, they will get back to you within 5 to 15 minutes, and then they will resolve all the queries. Also, you have a big platform forum where you're going to search the questions with very detailed step-by-step -step video, how you can do it yourself. So I'd say up listing is more suitable for small business owners who are actually just starting out the short-term management or property management business. I would say it's good for up to 15, maybe 25 properties max, because after that, you probably need a more sophisticated software. Because with up listing, they're still an early startup and they need to implement a lot of new features that are currently in the development, but it might take a while before it actually gets to your business.